Hey everyone, so it's been a while since I last did a monthly faves video. It's, it's been a few months, it's been about like three months. I think the last one I did was May. So that means I've got June, July and August to talk about, so that's great. So for today's video, I'm going to be mixing the three months and do a June, July, August faves video. So as usual, I will be listing my five favorite things. Um, I have limited it to five for today, even though I'm going over three months, just because it would be too long a video and I really don't want to have to do that. So I am still limiting it to five items. Some of these items you will have seen before because I will have gone over them briefly in other videos, but today it's just about the faves. So, so the first one, is my little cactus light. Uh, I did mention this one in my I've moved to England video. Um, it was a gift from my aunt. It's from Asda and I saw it when I went in Asda and I was like oh my god I need that light. It is just beautiful. Um, so it lights up. I don't know if it's showing very well on camera. But it, it's green, um, so it's got a little switch on the bottom, so you just put batteries in, so it's not a plug-in one. The second item on the list are two things, but they're technically the same thing, so I'm going to list them as one thing. And it is these pleated skirts. So these are both from H&M, I'm pretty sure they were £15 each. Um, if you know me, you know that I am a huge fan of pleated skirts. I got this one first. I thought it was really cute. But I looked online on H&M's website to see if they do have any other colours and I found out that they do stock this one in this lovely burgundy. So, of course, I had to buy that one as well. And they fit really nicely, they are very comfortable. These plates, I, don't, I swear, they don't need ironing, they just stay in place. Even after washing, they just, they just stay in place. So that's really good. The blue one is starting to pill a little bit. I don't know why. I think it's just because I wear it a lot and it's probably just from wearing it a lot in all the movement. I don't know. I'm mean, still that strong, so. Okay, the next one is something that I have mentioned before and actually did an entire video on. It is my new Kankin. So this is the Ox Red Kankin Owl. <laughs> the Ox Red Kankin uh, is probably my favourite one that I've got. I have two. I've got the yellow one and now I've got this one and this one is probably by far my favourite one. It's just so easy to style and I love this kind of colour. I love burgundy, maroon, things like that. So I think that, that goes with a lot of my things and it's just, it's so big it's you, know, you can fit so much in it. The fourth item on my list, again, is something that I bought two of, but I count them as one because they're basically the same thing. It is these two tops. So these are from Paul and Bear, which is a shop that I had heard about in New Zealand but didn't have any access to. And so when I found it in Manchester, I had to go in. I want a few things, but these are the two that are definitely my favourite. I'm a big Van Gogh fan, I love Van Gogh's work. I think these were £20, I'll have to check. Put the price here. I'm not sure if they still sell them, I hope they do. Okay, the final thing that I will be talking about today, you can barely even see it is, it's over there. You see? You see what I'm talking about? Ah uh, yeah, you know. So I finally got a Monstera blend. I have wanted a Monstera a cheese plant, whatever you want to call it, for a while. And I never got one in New Zealand because they were about $80. But I found this one when I was looking for a cafe. I found this very cute cafe, um, didn't end up going in, but I found a flower shop very close to it. And I noticed that they were selling uh, Monstera plants for $11.95. And that's pounds, that's not dollars, that's pounds. That is about 12 pounds for a Monstera. Here I was contemplating paying $80 for one when I could pay 12 pounds. And it is a little baby one. It's not 
fully grown, so it's quite small. It's probably only about like this, this big. So it's pretty, it's pretty small. Um, it does have a few of its iconic rips in it. Um, only on three of the leaves. Love it. I can't wait for it to grow big and put it into a nice little pot and just display it. But yeah, that is the end of this video. I uh, really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Comment in the comments down below what your favorite things from the past few months have been. If you are a fan of Vincent van Gogh, or who your favorite painter is, uh, or if you are fam uh, familiar with Colin Bear, opinions on Kankin, if you have one of your favorite colorers, things like that. Because that is the end of this video. I really hope you did enjoy it and I hope to see you all in the next one. Bye bye.